Matte Light Studio and Ultralight Aircraft SP30 welcomes you. In this video I will tell you about engine startup and warming up. Our engine had been prepared for startup and now we consider the standard startup procedure. Open the fuel shut-off valve. The fuel pump operation with closed shut-off valve is prohibited. It can be damaged. Turn on the battery and current breaker. Let's perform cold engine motoring. To do this make sure that the ignition is off and throttle is set to the idle. Control the oil pressure by the oil pressure indicator. Hold the start button until oil pressure increased at least 2 bar. Don't hold the button more than 10 seconds, as it causes overheat and damage the starter. Make sure that the oil radiator and coil flaps are closed. Pull the mixture handle to reach. Turn on the fuel pump to make a pressure in the fuel system not above 0.4 bar to avoid overflowing. Turn on both ignition switches, move throttle on one fourth forward and press the start button. If the oil pressure is safe, we increase the engine speed to 2000-2100 rpm. Don't leave the engine to run on low rpm more than 5 minutes in order to avoid spark plug carbon fouling. Observe the indicators while warming. Now you can enable other energy consumers. The GNS430 has standard logic with custom visualization and starting up. Continue warming up the engine on 2500 rpm if the temperatures are above 50 degrees Celsius. After warming up the engine, set the engine speed to 4000 rpm and one by one turn off and on ignition switches. RPM drop should not exceed 150 RPM. It was a video about starting up the engine. Thanks for watching. Subscribe to the channel to keep up with the latest news.